Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Thank you for watching, I appreciate it so much. Today I'm going to be hunting here in Hirschfelden for some diamond geese. Now I know I already have around two or three in my trophy lodge, but I just want to add a few more to the walls to make it look a bit more even and to have a few more level one animals that are diamond. Now before I get into the actual hunt, I just want to say thank you guys so much for blowing up my most recent video that I uploaded on Tuesday. It really makes me happy to see that you guys enjoy the videos that I upload and it really inspires me to make more YouTube content for you guys. Anyways, let's get right into it. Alright guys, so in my opinion, this is the best goose hunting setup that I use all the time. So as you can see right here, I have my 20 decoys set up right here on this massive field in Hirschfelden. Now this field right here is extremely good just because it's super big and there's a lot of space for the geese to come down and land then i have a layout blind set out in the center it doesn't have to be a layout blind but you can use tripod stands or whatever blind you want then i have this canada goose collar which is right here and i'll just sit inside of this layout blind and call the geese in when they come down then i'll take a shot at them Alright guys, I just spotted my first Canada Goose, and there are some fallow deer here as well. But here is that level 2 male Canada Goose, and I want to try and take a shot on him with the Hawk Edge bow using the 300 green arrows, because I'm very curious to see what kind of damage it does, and see how fast it puts down this goose. Alright, I should be able to take a shot right there on this single one. That shot looked good. Let's see what happens. His health is definitely going down. Maybe I should put a second shot in. Okay, that one missed. But he's already down. He just dropped right there. Alright, let's go see what his score was. I'm actually kind of surprised that he flew that far even with the arrow right where I thought it would hit long. Let's see. Okay, so I hit him in the right scapula. So, oh my gosh, these arrows have absolute no penetration. That is actually very different from the rest of the arrows, which are used for bigger animals. But I got him at 22 yards, and it still only gave me 66% quick kill. That is actually very surprising. Okay, so I have another big flock of geese coming down. And, uh... There doesn't seem to be too many high levels in this flock. They're probably all going to be silver, but when they land on the ground, I'm going to try and take one out with the Cacciatore 12 gauge pump action shotgun. And when they're flying away, I'm going to see how many I can get as well. So let's see what happens. They're landing really, really close to my blind. Look at them right there in front of me. They still don't see me though. Okay, this one's landing really close. Oh no, he spooked. Took him out. Smoked that one as well. Okay, there's some trying to escape. Took that one out. Alright, that one's dead. I shot him twice and he still didn't go down. Okay, never mind. His health is rapidly decreasing. Alright, there's one trying to escape out there. Let's see if we can get him with the 22. It's a far shot. Oh, and he's down as well. Alright, so I'm going to claim these geese, not in order that I shot them, but that one's a silver. And I have another one over here. I think this was the one that I had to shoot twice. Yeah, just a silver as well. I can already hear the geese coming down to land, trying to come down and land. And then I have two right by my layout blind, so let's see. This was a silver. And so was this one. That was pretty nice. But that still gave me around 4,000 cash for those four geese. So that's perfect. And I know that I definitely dropped one out on this field. I don't know how far out with the 22 as he was flying away. But he did look like the biggest one. And he had a potential of actually being diamond. I don't know what his score was. Let 
he was much closer than I thought. And yeah, I got him in the right lung at 166 yards, and he was a really nice size gold. Okay, I have another flock coming in at this other spot that I decided to go to. And it's actually a diamond potential, really nice size level 4. So I want to shoot him on the floor to make sure I definitely get him. But let's see how many we can get out of this flock. Man, there are a bunch here. Alright, let's take him out. And Smoke that one. Smoke that one. Smoke that one. And I smoked that one as well. <laughs> that worked out great. I must have gotten at least five geese with six shots. Let's see what this one was. Just a silver, level three. And then we got a bunch. Yeah, another silver, level two. Another silver, level two. Another silver, level two again. And this was the diamond potential. And he was just a gold, but a really nice size, 7.2, level four. Okay, I have an absolute massive flock of geese coming in. There must be at least 20 here. And I definitely don't even have enough ammo in my 22 or my 12 gauge pump to take these all out. But let's see how many I can put down. They're definitely going to land pretty close to me. And they're probably going to spook very soon. Okay, they already spooked. Okay, that one went down. Oh my god, look at all these. Okay, there's two more smoke. Missed. Okay. Those didn't go down, so I'm gonna finish them off with the 22. Okay, that one's down as well. Let's see if we can get maybe another one. Dropped. Perfect. Alright, so I definitely have a bunch of geese piled up. This one was just a female, so it was a bronze. This one was a silver. Probably like the rest of them. This one, I'm betting, is going to be a silver as well. And yes, this one's actually a bronze female. Okay, and then I have three more over here. Or maybe even a few more. Yeah, four more. No, three. And this one is also a silver. And so is this one. This one is also silver like the rest. And what is this one going to be? Probably silver. Yep, 5.6 silver. Okay, I have a really nice flock of geese coming down now. And there is, I think, a brown hybrid, which is a rare one, coming down to land. So I definitely want to take that one out. But I also want to try and get down some of these other males for respawn purposes. But naturally, the one I want, which is the rare, is the farthest away. So, I don't know. I may get it. I may not get it. But let's see what happens. Alright, they all landed now. Wait for that one to land, and then I'll take a shot. Alright, that one right there. Okay, there's the rare. Okay, he's dropped. Let's get some of these. Okay, that one's down. Alright, that one should go down. Now. And that one's dropped. Alright, let's go check. Okay, so I can definitely see the rare goose that I just shot right in front of me. And it did look like it was pretty nice size. But... Yeah, it was a uh, level 3 very easy gold brown hybrid goose. So that's actually really cool. And I'm definitely going to add this uh, this goose to the lodge. So there's one we get to put in. Okay, I have one single goose coming in. It's a level 4 very easy. But it's not going to be a diamond potential just because it's not max weight. But I should definitely get a nice size gold out of it if I'm able to put it down. So I'm curious to see what will happen. Because I am going to be trying out the Hawk Edge bow with the uh, 300 grain arrows. So I'm probably going to aim for a lung shot just because 
on the last goose I used the bow I didn't get a hundred percent quick kill but I didn't hit a vital so I'm going to maybe aim for lung or neck or wherever I can maybe put the goose down faster when using the bow but I have to make sure he lands first without spooking him Okay, I can't spot him when I'm standing in the blind, but I'm going to find the range immediately and then go straight back into the blind. Okay, 57 yards, I think. All right, I need to shoot him quick before he spooks. So maybe side in for 44. Oh, he got dropped. That was a perfect shot. Okay, now that's actually something that makes me much happier because now I know that I can actually drop a goose with a bow. So let's see. I got him in the left lung at 47 yards, and he was a nice size gold. That's pretty cool. I got a really nice size flock of geese coming in right now. So... Once they get really close, I'm just going to start blasting. I think I'm going to take that one right there. All right, he's down. Okay, that one's down as well. That one's also down. These two right here. Dropped. And also dropped. Okay. Oh, man, I'm out of ammo. Let me see if I can finish him off with the 22. Down. All right, there's one trying to escape. Put two shots in him with the 22, and he's down. So I think I got six out of that flock. And that one was a nice little silver. Level two. This was a female. Level one bronze. And then I think I have three over here. Let me see, I can't tell. Yeah, I got three. This one was also a silver. And this one was a level four gold. Pretty nice size gold. So that's pretty cool. And this one was a level one female. That was bronze. Now, I think I dropped one more out in this field. Let me see if I can go find them. Okay, here it is. And it was a silver. Okay, I just spotted a huge level four goose that actually has a really good chance of being a diamond so here it is right there and you can see its max weight and its trophy score is from 8 to 9 and that a diamond goose is 8.5 so this one could potentially be a nice size diamond so let me see if I can take him down if he lands without being alerted which he already is I really don't want him to flee I'll try and take him out with the bow because that would be really cool to get a diamond goose with the bow. But there he is right there. And I really want to get a shot on him. Please don't spook. Please don't spook. Oh man, please don't spook. He is massive. He is massive. That's a huge goose right there. Oh no, he just spooked. He just spooked. Okay. Oh, I just dropped him. Okay, here's the goose. And I really hope it's a diamond. If it is a diamond, that would actually be my first level 4. That would make diamond, but let's see what he scores. I'm really excited. And oh my gosh, he just barely made it. He just barely made being diamond. But anyways, I got him with a 12 gauge catchatory pump action shotgun at 43 yards. And um, I'm really happy with that. There's another goose I get to add to the lodge. And I think I'm going to put him right alongside the brown hybrid. That's the gold. So that's pretty cool. Okay, I'm back here in the trophy lodge now. And you can see I've got the diamond Canada goose right here. And back there on the wall, you can see the uh, brown hybrid um, gold goose I got as well. So I'm pretty happy that I got these two in my lodge now. And I think they look pretty cool. So I think I'm going to wrap up the video here now. If you enjoyed it, 
please consider leaving a like and commenting, and I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching.